Hi ladies and gents, this is Seriously Scrappy. So happy I can finally film. I uh, found my SD card because I don't have memory on my phone to film. And the good thing about this is you don't see the words backwards because remember on my phone um, when I had to film you would say words would be backwards. So yeah. Anyway, I wanted to share this. It just came in the mail and I'm guessing it's from eBay because lately... Well, I've got this obsession the last six months of buying 1800 Circa scrapbook albums and early 1800 uh, and 1900 ephemera, I mean late 1800, early 1900 ephemera postcards, greeting cards, stuff like that. So I just bid on them on eBay. Um, yeah, I just type in scrapbook. 1800 scrapbook on ebay or 1800 ephemera stuff like that and um auction just bid on auctions because uh, they're the best prices and so they very kindly put it on a thick this thick cardboard that's been stuck in this envelope and this has come from the uk about five pounds to ship it uh, okay. Many thanks, client. Oh, that's nice. I don't know if that says client. I'm pretty sure it does, client. Okay, so. Um, it's always nice when they put it in protective, and this is good quality protective. Uh, so we've got that one there. Oh wow, okay. Oh, that's gorgeous. So there's the front there. Let me just have a look on my phone on eBay so I can just um, find how much I paid for these purchases. Um, sorry, guys. And the back is just like this, and it says Jack there. Okay. So this is another one. Uh, wishing you a happy new year. I think this is like Dutch. This writing on the back, Halrishima Falkland. There. And then there is this gorgeous shoe. Look at that gorgeous die cut there isn't that beautiful what does that say on the hill there it says wishing you a happy new year can you see that there and on the back here is a little stamp uh, castle brothers printed in Bavana Beautiful. Okay, so that's one lot there. Just want to see if I can see that. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, let's have a look at the next lot. Oh, oh my gosh. How gorgeous is that? Oh my gosh. Let's see if I can find that there. Oh, it's not gorgeous. Well, 
Oh, okay. So these two cards were seven dollars forty-five Australian. Um, friendship greetings, and this has been sewn. See that? It's been sewn. How gorgeous is that? And the inside. Wow. Oh, this will go in a very precious journal. Christmas to you from. Don't understand that. And the reason why I picked this is for the letter M for Madison. <laughs> Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? And that lovely little Christmas holly in the M. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, and that's how it looks like. So, so pretty. And the inside. There's the inside. This one hasn't been written on. So pretty. With healthy Christmas greetings from Mr. and Mrs. Monday, 13 Terrace, Crystal Terrace, Promenade, Blackpool. Okay, so these people would have uh, had a bit of money. But this does look hand done. Gorgeous. Um, so it says that I paid seven forty five for those two. Can't find these ones here. Oh, these are okay. Um, the one with the leg, the legs, I don't know where they're coming from. It's got me stumped, but anyway, let, let's keep, keep on going with that. Now these ones, I'll just put these down for a minute. These are nicely wrapped. Oh, how cool. And I can use that in journals, what this lovely um, seller. I always buy from this seller. And I'm not going to tell you their name because then I'll be bidding with you. <laughs> and you've probably got more money than me, so. Okay, now these two cards are gorgeous. I'll just hold them here while I try to find how much I paid for them. Is that it? Hold on. Okay, so I paid. Yeah, I paid seven forty-five for these. They look so much better in person because on here the colour looks too bright. Uh, let me show you. Mm -hmm. See how the colour here looks really bright? So in person they look far more vintage, better looking. So for these two I paid... Seven forty-five Australian or three ninety-nine pound plus three seventy-three postage, but um, she combined postage, so it would have been a bit cheaper than that. So this is interesting. So it looks like this is like some type of paper that's been cut with scissors that are. Uh, like you know those pinky shoes but not quite and they've stuck it onto um 
This looks like another one within itself. It's probably not as nice as this picture. And they've put a little sticker on the bottom there. So that is an original card of some sort. And then they've stuck this image on top. And that's really cool. I don't mind that. And on the back it says to something with... Anyway... <laughs> that fancy smancy writing there it says a love token this one says with my love uh, these girls look like girls and they're kind of sexualizing them um, yeah the back there. They look like little eight, nine year old girls. Look, maybe they yeah, with love it doesn't necessarily mean I don't know. But young girls shouldn't be dressed like little ladies. But anyway, back then maybe that's what they did. Okay, moving on. Oh jeez, so that jacket. Alright, so there's another little protective film there. Oh, and another one of these. I wonder how she wants me to open that. Now we've got a few of these. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. The reason why I'm counting them is so I can look back. Okay, eleven postcards from Vrolish Kirstafi, Holland. Okay, so I paid seven forty five for these. These say Netherlands, Holland, Dutch, 1940 to 1950. Okay, so this one says 1949 on the back, the stamp. And this is the, the postcard there. I wish you a happy Easter, Dora Gappins. And this is going to England, Epsom Dawns. England's it's another beautiful card it's a lovely winter scene I believe the year no can't make it out it's another beautiful card it's a lovely map postcard there's a lovely writing on the back with the kind of thoughts and best wishes for a happy Christmas and a bright new year we are all very well and hoping from you all the same because me for not wish writing anyway that that's my bird flapping in its uh, cage it's lovely. Gorgeous. These are the first cards that I've gotten that aren't so old, like early 1900s. Uh, this one is 1953. I love the little gold kind of... See the little gold trimmings? 
Oh my gosh, this is a gorgeous Easter one. Look at this one. So pretty. Unfortunately, I can't make out the um, the other. There's another one. Some, some interesting stamps, Dutch stamps. Oh wow, another lovely winter wonderland theme there. Some more beautiful writing. Another Christmas winter wonderland. Not that way, so and Christmas. Oh wow! Oh, I love the golden boss riding down there. So pretty. Ups and downs, sunny England. Nineteen forty-six, the twentieth of the twelfth. Nineteen forty-six, just at the end of the war. I wonder if they mention that. We. We. Something. Our best wishes for a happy Christmas and New Year. I hope you're well. And again, many. Blah, blah. I don't suppose they're going to mention the war and a happy Christmas thing, are they? Hmm. 53, I think. That will be a lovely floral. And here's another one there. Yeah. All with the lovely writing on the back. So, yeah. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Very happy with those. And more to add to my collection. Oh wow. Well. Mm. Well my, my favourite would have to be the uh I'd probably say these two gorgeous. The birdie one is so cute. The birdie one. And the M for Maddie. <laughs> well, the Monday family. Yeah, alright. Thanks all for watching. Bye.